Well, I kind of was walking over here. Let's do one more crushing for Christ, shall we? Hope you enjoyed the little adventure today on the 18th day on Friday night. Kind of walk back towards the rental car. A little cool area down here. Very, very nice. What the hell? Kind of reminds me of the uh, Trees of Mystery up by Eureka. But, you know. Yeah, sun's going down. Got to get back to the hotel in the outskirts. But, uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. It was kind of fun. Try to get some more crushing of Christ behavior going on. I think this is the way it came out when I was going. Yeah, here it is. Yeah. Hate watching. It's never ending behavior. Never ending. But uh, it's a beautiful day in Florida. It's not too bad. I mean, I've seen worse. I've been down to Cocoa Beach before. You know, my birthday a couple of years ago. I think during COVID, I think. Went down there. That was when they were, uh, that um, the racist bastards and uh, got into, got into, they ran people over in that one town. What the hell it was. The hunch talked about how they were good size of both sides. That was that weekend I was down there. That's what the hell that was. But, uh, Cold Beach was fun. It was hot. Went to the Florida um, Seafood Company. That was good. Kind of remind me of uh, Red Lobster, but more personal. It's too bad all those are closed. Yeah, I, you know, hopefully I can buy uh, your boy a cup of coffee. Hang out in the outskirts. Be kind of epic, you know. But here, man, I'm here to crush with Christ, crush Christ with you. You know. We talk about Social Security. Yeah, I'm. I'm a feeble old man. I could take mine early. I don't have to worry about that behavior. I got a nice nest egg. And I qualify for a, uh, what was it, $3,800 a month for a, uh, what do you call those things? Um, keep forgetting pension plan. So, the hell. My dad died a year and a half before he retired from the railroad. My mom was divorced from him, and I told her, you're not getting remarried because someone's got to get his $4,200. And she was making whatever it was from the government, five grand. So, she was able to live uh, comfortably. She's already had money in the first place, so. That was good. To, she didn't remarry somebody. Yeah, I figured hit on back, what the hell. Do one more here. Timmy, wanna buy a cup of coffee, bro? What is coffee these days? What is it for coffee? Don't even have any change on me. But uh, oh, you never know. I mean, I'm not here to stop the guy, but I figured he might be down here. You know, what the hell? Come on down, talk to his young ass and say, hey, dude, but drowny. What do you think of all these hate channels? You know, what do you think about this kind of behavior? What's going on? You know, bold faced line, what the hell are you doing? You know, it is what it is. But, oh, man, I'm hungry. I don't want to do a night for dinner somewhere. I'll get my buddy tomorrow. Saturday. But, yep. We're crushing, man. Damn right we are. And we are having the time of our lives. Getting kind of low here, the red, so if it goes off, that means there's no more crushing. But uh, it is what it is. Probably a bike, yeah, it's a bike trail. See the things down there? They come cruising. Kind of remind me of the Oregon or something up there in Washington, Washington. Go looking for Bigfoot, right? Up there in the uh, New York, up there, the Appalachians. You know, go up there, go for the bottomless snowman. My favorite idiots will always be the ghost train, North Carolina. And they're on the railroad tracks, thinking the train's a ghost train. One jumped off, one got hit, the other one got drilled. 
They thought the train was a ghost train. Thought out the hard way. I get ghosts. I get all that behavior. Who knows? UFOs. I don't know. Come get me, man. We'll crush Christ together. Come get my young ass. I don't know. I don't know. I mean, one time I think when I was 12, I was sliding a buddy of mine. Something was over me for about 10 minutes and just kind of pfft, took off. I don't know what it was, but ghosts and Bigfoot and ghosts, it's like a Bigfoot. It's just going to be walking through the woods and all of a sudden it's going to appear on the other side in front of you. You're not going to go looking for it, yelling and hollering in the middle of the woods. You know, walk on the corner, there'll be a bear. You never know, right? But uh, I don't know. Yep, I'm going to have him back to the car here. I hope you enjoyed the little series, Crushing for Christ in Sarasota. We'll uh, do some more of that stuff, behavior. Another place I want to go to if I get a chance. I want to buy the guy a cup of coffee. I want to put him on the board directors of Speculation Sports, even a fear mongering radio, spreading fear and cheers throughout the world. I asked a YouTuber to come on. He yells and hollers all the time. He's friends with Daily Wu. He's a Philly guy. Too chicken to come on the podcast. But, uh, but a lot of people don't know how to call into a podcast. I don't really know how to call a phone, but uh, who knows? But yeah, you guys, crushing for Christ. We're getting this done. Walking around. We're getting closer and closer to the end. We hope everybody enjoyed a little crushing for Christ. Tim, where are you? Dude, but Johnny, where are you? Colors are nice. They're nice. Oh, yeah. Huh. That's right. Once in a while, you got to do some crushing for Christ. Right? You got to go look for your favorite YouTuber and, you know, walk up and demand an autograph. You know, hey, man, Tim, give me an autograph, dude. Man, I, I hate watch you, you know. You know, all the blind views and people out there that nonstop skullduggery, never leave their house. Wait for a new video because he does like three or four days, so that gets these people. Their food is their food is three times a day. They're getting fed, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. They're consuming and consuming and consuming the guy. That's what they're doing. So the more more content, more food he puts out, the haters love it. They just they think it's the greatest thing in the world. So he gives them he gives them breakfast once in a while. He gives them brunch, maybe dessert. That smirk on his face in his house. You know, and these people just can't wait. You know, give a sub. I'll worry about what he says. It's just, to me, it's epic behavior, you know. But yeah. Head on back to the hotel. You know, get a nice sleep. So, you got a tennis court over there. You can play tennis, too, as well, so. Can you imagine trying to rake all these leaves up? Oh my goodness. Like I said, we put this in a non-monetized channel. We didn't want to be accused of pimping and prostituting the young man. Accused of dick riding him, right? So, it is what it is. So, we tell people bike here too as well. So, yeah, you guys. Hope you enjoyed the little free video montage. We'll do some tomorrow, maybe someplace, other place we get a chance. And we'll uh, continue to crush for Christ this weekend. Buy his young ass a cup of coffee. And he'll probably be out later in October. He'll be long back home, so we will have the time of our lives. So, hope you enjoyed a little adventure of hiking. You know, looking for your favorite piece of food. Mm hmm. So. I want to, like I said, I want to buy him an actual cup of coffee. You know? That's the thing now for on YouTube. Buy me a cup of coffee. Just say, give me a donation. 
Look, his, what's his name? Um, um, Camo Dave just asked for money. That's what he did. The platform is for that. That's all it is now. No one can do their content. It's just give me, give me, give me, give me. But in closing, like I said, if my mother-in-law wants to have daily depart a sweetheart, best mother-in-law you ever could have. Never hurts to ask. Never hurts to ask. So, anyways, you guys. Question for Christ. Having the time of our lives. And uh, Tim, wherever you're out here in San Francisco, I hope I see you around. If not, you know, I tried. I wanted to buy you something, maybe take you to Walmart. So, anyways, from the outskirts, having the time of our lives. Just remember, man, I did not have sexual relations with that woman, Miss Sawinski. Yahoo. See y'all later.